Hey, it's Bruce coming to you once again with WeedersDigest.com. Today I'm going to show you a guaranteed way to knock down your weeds, cover up your muck, and make almost a perfect beach in just one afternoon. Here's what it is. It's called our new Lake Blanket. And the Lake Blanket is set up where it's you can cover 24 feet by 28 feet by laying this screening type material down. You can see right through it, so that means that the bottom of the lake will breathe. And what you do is we've, we've got these sewn pockets in. So you simply just insert one of our tubes, which you fill with you know just typical sand using a, uh, your basic funnel. It comes with all the, all the parts. Everything's included in the package that we would send you, with the exception of the sand. You can buy that at your local hardware store or local Home Depot or those type of places as long as it's dry sand. That's the biggest key to it. Now, when you lay this down, you can literally just float it out over the lake let it drop into its place. It'll smother the weeds, it'll cover up the, the muck, and then because of this breathing process, it doesn't get gases underneath it, and it actually firms up the bottom. It's hard to understand, but I've seen it myself. I've been practicing with this for a number of years. Actually, for about seven years, I've been using uh, light blankets in testing processes. Now, I do want to caution you and say that there are some states and some countries that actually do not allow this. And, you know, normally when we think of something that is, um, uh, you know, not allowed by a government, usually you're thinking it's a, a safety issue or hazardous or something for the environment. Here's the truth behind it. If, if we allowed people to go out, they would literally cover up whole bays and whole, you know, canals and, you know, waterfronts with this type of material. But the problems with it is that if, if people just get the idea that all you got to do is go to the hardware store and buy some kind of a tarp and lay it down, well, there gets gases underneath it because of the, uh, the biomass that's down there. And suddenly you get big bubbles. And um, I know stories of people actually having it lift up and literally float over to a neighbor's and then no one will lay claim to it. It also can get into props if you don't have it laying flat or if somebody just grounds, you know, hits the ground in that area. So those are the reasons why in Minnesota, where they're not allowed, that's the reason why Minnesota has not allowed them is because people have used um, improper material and that improper material was managed improperly and then it caused problems for the people around it, boaters or neighbors. So um, do me a favor, stop by foryourshore.com or weedersdigest.com, check out our lake blanket. You'll be um, amazed by the results that you can get and I'm telling you, you can put this together, lay out a 24 by 28 um, platform, put it out on the bottom of the lake. You can do it in a couple of hours. Um, doesn't take much skill, doesn't take any tools required whatsoever, other than I recommend a small little shovel, just like a garden shovel, and sand from the hardware store. So this is Bruce with WeedersDigest.com. I think this is a great option for you if you're in the right state. Check it out and give us a call. Thank you.